This is supposed to be a video of my bridging gone wrong. Oh, I can check this out. It's fine. They don't need sound. I just need to figure out what's going wrong with the bridging and anything else you might see. Obviously it's really dark, but maybe there's a better angle. I'm looking on Prawner face and it looks like it's almost ready to print the bridge, so... I'm relatively confident that it's going to fail. Because the, all of the other previous bridging attempts have been pretty awful. All right, here we go. Oh my gosh, it's actually... Oh yeah, okay. Oh, sorry, I was watching with my eyes and not... So you can see that it's... Just drizzling crap down the center. It's not... It's not bridging at all, actually. Looks like... Oh, sorry. Um... It attaches to one end and then never actually makes it to the other. And then just drizzles it all down the center. Here's round two, I guess. Try to keep it on this. I keep trying to watch it through real life and not through the camera. Stupid lighting is really bad in here. Alright, so this time it bridged a little bit. Kind of see. Sort of. It's really hard, but. Oh, man. I need a flashlight. Get my camera out. Get my phone. Light it up a little bit. <laughs> Not the best light source, but it'll kind of do. Alright, so it looks like it's actually kind of bridging pretty well right now. But I mean, that first experience, I mean, you saw it, it was pretty sloppy. It was just drizzling down in. So. Yeah, I'm not really sure. My temperature is 167 Celsius. Actually, I got it. I got it down to 120. Actually, set to 110 before it stopped printing perfect or smoothly. It started, you know, getting crunchy little little bits <laughs> instead of a string. It was just little specks. So yeah, 160 seems kind of high. Surprisingly, you'd think it'd need to be around 185. I don't know what the deal is with this filament, but it's got really low. Okay, so here's the finished product. Um, you can see here, maybe my E-steps are kind of low or something because it's supposed to be, well, it's at 20% fill, but that's supposed to be a solid surface, and clearly it's not, so if I could get some tips for that too, that'd be really nice. Alrighty, thank you. Pretty smooth on the sides.